they really made some great construction to make this temple more like a Zen temple. Give it a lot of a Zen flavor to the temple. I am at Jade Buddha Temple of Shanghai today. Before the COVID, when I was a tour guide, I came here pretty often, twice a week. I haven't been inside this temple in last three years, for three years. This temple was built in 1928, so not very old. But how to say this temple is still worth paying a visit because there are, because of the two pieces of jade statues carved in Myanmar, Burma. First building is a four heavenly kings hall. The four heavenly kings are the four most important guardians who protect the Buddhist world and Buddhist law. Now you can see a laughing Buddha in the four heavenly kings hall. He received all the Buddhist believers with his big smile. Facing the grand hall is the chief guardian, Wei Tuo. Whoever comes to this temple with their prayers, it's his duty to report to Buddha. Guan Yin, goddess of great mercy. She is the most important Bodhisattva. People often come, often come to her and recite her name and we believe she will hear us she will come to us and help us out in 2017 that building in front of us was moved from where i am standing towards north for 30 meters the entire building was lifted by a crane then put it on a track then slide it over it took 30 months to do that and it is the first biggest project construct, construction or project happened to this temple. Actually, the building was moved together with all the statues and sculptures inside. So the total weight was estimated 2,000 tons. That humongous thing was moved, slide over for 30 minutes, 30 meters. Incense burner. A Peter with Buddhist inscriptions. I am in the Grand Hall right now. Now I can see Buddha sitting there with three. It's Buddha, Sakamuni, and uh, Medicine Buddha, and Amitabha. Here, on both sides of the Buddha, there are 20 statues. 二十诸天 in Chinese. There are students and guardians from Buddha, of Buddha. So their body are slightly leaning forward as if they were listening to Buddha's teaching at this moment. The most important figure in this sculpture, in this cluster of sculpture is Guan Yin, Bodhisattva, Goddess of Great Mercy. On top is Buddha old man sitting there that is buddha in his meditation he had uh, he spent six years in meditation there was no food no supply so he aged a lot next we're gonna see the two piece of jade statues i have to tell you i have to tell you that a lot of visitors tourists without a tour guide they couldn't find those two pieces of jade Buddhas. <laughs> They're missing the highlights of this temple. And first is, first we're gonna see the reclining Buddha. This is the jade Buddha. Reclining Buddha. 
made of me Burma, Myanmar. The big Buddha. One piece of jade. The jade has a, such a beautiful luster and a fine texture. So peaceful. Thing is, in, in this temple, you still could see monks. So it means this is still an active religious monastery. People burn incense here, make wishes, and burn incense here. Basically, you need to follow the sign to go to the Jade Buddha Hall. It's hard to find. Look at the small sign it says Yu Fu Dian Jade Buddha Hall. So you find you need to find this place to see the Jade Buddha. There's beautiful wooden, mostly wood, like Buddhist artworks. Look at this. Buddhist artworks. Nancy Reagan was here in 1984. Uh, this is the Jade Buddha. It's almost two meter tall. One piece of jade as well. Ah, uh, it's a nice temple. In my hometown, Shanxi, all the temples are famous for its old wall paintings, sculptures, and architectures. This temple is not that old. The temple has really beautiful jade statues of Buddha. If you are in Shanghai, if you want to learn something about Buddhism, Chinese Buddhism especially, and come and visit Jade Buddha Temple. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you soon.